Uh, as always, it's a pleasure, Liam Beckett here, you know, a man that's uh, famed for his hairstyle and his opinions on local football. Liam, uh, great to have you. Local football this season, the Irish League, your reflection so far? Yeah, a couple, of, a couple of interesting things, Adrian. At the top, not a great deal of difference. Crusaders leading, uh, Linfield second. Uh, what's impressed me has been the form of the uh, provincial clubs, in particular Corey and Balamina and Glenavon. And to be honest, Balamina, after having a 6 0 hammer in the very first day of the season, have really come good and have shown great form. A uh, couple of mishaps along the way, but uh, they're up to this top six. They haven't been there for a long time. I think they'll finish in the top six. Yeah, I think I've been impressed by the provincial clubs. Interesting too that, certainly with regard to Balamina, there was talk and rumour and speculation, even in the early days, where people were saying, you know, would David Jeffrey even last at the, the showgrounds? And look what he's done. Of course, and you know, he's, he, he, he hasn't went out and signed big-name players. A lot of people thought, ah, they'll bring David Jeffrey. he'll need a checkbook because when he was at Linfield, they have the big checkbook. That was never really the case as well. I know some players, when David Jeffrey was winning the, those major trophies at Linfield, that only signed for Linfield, not because they were getting more money, they were actually getting offered more money elsewhere, but they went there because of him. They went there because of the status of the club and that there was always a great chance they would win major trophies and get to Europe and so on. All the trimmings that comes with success. Uh, and he's proven that going to Balamina United. He's went there on a strict budget. Uh, they don't overspend at Balamina United. They, no they run a good there, tight show. Man. They're tight, you know that. And, <laughs> and the club's no different. The club, the club runs the, the way a club should be run. It runs in the black. Uh, I don't know how much in the black, and it's none of my business, but I know they run a good tight ship. David has come in under the, that, uh, th those guidelines and has signed players at the beginning of the season. I knew it needed major surgery. He has uh, signed players from the championship and he has signed players who perhaps weren't first team choice at other clubs and they've come good for him. And I put that down to good man management on his part and obviously now he's taken them into the top six. The crowd's re a real buzz around Balamina. They're all excited. They see uh, good times ahead. So do I. I. I don't necessarily say that team will take them to the championship, uh, to win the championship. I think that takes them to the next phase and then he'll strengthen again and he'll keep doing that till he gets a team worthy of winning the Irish League title. Well done.